Hi friends, Miss Megan is going to the dictionary today for our lesson. Get excited. If you look up the word love in the dictionary, you will find multiple meanings. In fact, you will find multiple parts of speech for love as well. Love can be considered a noun for the feeling that you might have, but we are going to focus on the verb form of love today, the action of love. In 1 John 3.16, we are given the ultimate example of the action of love. This is how we know what love is. Jesus Christ laid down his life for us. Can you think of any greater action of love than what Jesus did on the cross for us? He loved us enough to die for our sins so that we could be forgiven, so that we could be with God. It's wonderful to have the feeling of love that we get from Jesus, but that kind of love is one that only we get to enjoy. When we take that feeling of love that we receive from Jesus and turn it into the action of love, so much more love gets spread around. The action of love means that we have to do something in love. That means that we don't keep Jesus' love bottled up inside. We act with love towards others, just like Jesus. Jesus was filled with love from God, but he didn't just sit around feeling God's love. He took that love and gave it to others. He healed, helped, taught, shared, and sacrificed, all in the action of love. So how are you going to act in love? Who will you love on? You haven't experienced all that love has to offer if you only feel it. Just like Jesus, you have to act on it. See you next week and happy Thanksgiving.